Ah! Oh, oh man, that was a good sleep. I am ready for the day ahead. Okay, so I should probably get some breakfast. Nah, maybe I'm gonna work up an appetite. I think I should take the dogs for a walk. It's been like a day or two, and I should be taking them every single day. Everybody knows that. Okay, so I've got my leash. Okay, I'm gonna head out to the garden now. Actually, no. Cap, you always let him away with it. I think we should go wake up Stark. Because he's always sleeping and he never brings the dogs for a walk. Poor old stump. Okay, come on, let's get up there and get him. Uh, uh, surprise, surprise, he's fast asleep, Stark. Oh my goodness, and he's snoring and everything. How is he... <laughs> he's such a snorer. How does he sleep in that suit? Oh wait, uh, I've got my leash, I'm gonna whip him. Hey, get up, get up. I don't wanna go to school today. Stark, come on, we gotta walk the dog. Stark, get up, come on. No, I don't wanna wear I don't wanna wear that suit. I wanna wear another suit. Oh my god, I gotta get Hawkeye. This is hilarious. Stark, wake up! Come on! Oh, 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 Cap, Cap is Wake that... Wake up, come on, man. You're still sleeping. It's like 10 a.m. Uh, uh did you do were you asking me to go to school today or something? No. Stark, you're like, I don't know what age you are, you're like over 30 years old or something like that. You're, you you don't go to school anymore. Oh, I don't know, I must have been having a dream. Were you were you jumping on my bed? Uh, n no. Mm, I don't know whether I believe you. Um, okay, so what what's so important that you had to wake me up from my beauty sleep? You know oh. I need my beauty sleep. Okay, well just take this because we're taking the dogs for a walk. It's about time you took little Stump for a walk. I always pay somebody else to take Stump for a walk. Yeah, but that's just lazy. You gotta do it yourself, man. Come on. Okay, okay. So where do we keep those guys again? Are you serious? I'm joking, I'm joking. I was down there yesterday feeding them, okay? All right, oh. okay. Well, yeah, it's over this way. You know, it's over by the farm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. While we're there, maybe I might feed some of the farm animals as well. Those guys, those pigs eat so much food. They pretty much eat anything at all. And I need to get them fresh mud as well. So, um, hey, come on. And when's the last time you saw uh, Pigzilla? What did we call him again? I didn't tell. We, did we name him? I know we had we had Percy. We have yeah, Percy. well, you have Percy, your prize pig. But the Pigzilla, remember, it, like, it didn't shrink all the way and it's still pretty big. Um, no, I don't think I've seen that guy in a while, but... Oh, wait, there he is. <laughs> he's so big. I don't know how he just doesn't break down the fence every time. I think it's because he's nice now, and he, I, I, I should take him for a walk. Look at the size of this guy. You'll scare people, Stark. Oh, there's Percy. Hey, Percy, sticking your head out at me. Hello, how are you? Mm. Oh, hey, come on, let's get down here. Let's check out the dogs. Okay, oh, there's my sheepies as well. Okay, so let's go down and check these guys out. Hey, there. look at Stumpy. Hey, there he is. Hey, straight hey. over. To oh, straight Stumpy, get back here. Stumpy. Stumpy, get back. Stop. Get back here. Stumpy, 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 come back. Come back, Stumpy. Come <laughs> on back. <laughs> okay, Stark. You get him. Let's go. I got him. I got him. Come on, Stumpy. Come on. Okay, uh, I got him. He's a good boy. He loves you, Stark. How are all these guys going? We got Snout and here we have Dave. Hey, Dave. Um, hey, how's, uh, hey, what's Snout, this? how come you're just laying down. Snout's usually the really energetic one. He's usually playing a lot. Where, why is he just sitting down there? Hey, Snout, he hasn't even touched his food. Oh. Um, let's check the other guys. Have they eaten their food? Yep, Dave has nearly finished his. And, yep, Stump has nearly finished his, so this is strange. Oh, is he kind of groaning? Uh-oh, Stark, maybe he's sick. Oh no, if he's sick, we're gonna have to get him to the vet or... Is it the vet or the, the pet? Hospital or the... It's, it's called a vet, right? I, yeah, I presume so, but I don't... Oh, man, I can't believe he's sick. That's not good. I don't really know any vets. Maybe we should um ask Jarvis or something? Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's one in the city, but I don't know the direction. So let's go in and talk to Jarvis. Hey, Jarvis, what's going on, buddy? Um, Me and Cap were just wondering if you could give us directions to a vet in the city. Um, one of the dogs looks quite sick, so is there anything you can do for us? Good morning, gentlemen. That is most unfortunate news about the dog. Well, in fact, sir, there is a veterinarian right beside the police station in the city. You should head there now. Mm, okay, I think we're quite familiar with the police station, so... 
That sounds like a plan. Hey, Cap, what do you say? Do you think we should just go straight there now? Yeah, I think so, Stark. I'm pretty worried about him, so uh, come on, let's go. Uh, hey, Cap, what's going on? Uh, is this the this is the police station, right? Yeah, this is the police station, and Jarvis said it was like right next door, so I think it could be down this way. Oh, okay, okay, so this way. Okay. I'm gonna leave my bike there because I'm not really sure which direction. Maybe if you fly ahead, see if you can find it. I'm pretty sure the bike will be safe outside the police station, also. Yeah. Oh, hey. Oh, look at these. Oh, yeah. Hey, look at this. It's got like a dog bone and a bowl of food. And that looks like a ball of yarn for like a cat. So this is very animal orientated. So, oh. Oh, look up here. Yeah, that's yeah, that's a cross as well. So, Stark, this has to be it. This has got to be it. This definitely got to be the vets. Uh, should we just go straight in? Yeah, go ahead. I'm right behind you. Okay, so let's have a look. Hmm. I think we got some more clues here, Cap. We got a <laughs> leash. We got a collar. We got some doggy treats, and I think that's some pork chops. Yeah, that's exactly what Snout likes. So, um, hey, let's see what this receptionist has to say. She might help us out. Hello, um, what's going on? We've got a sick doggy. So, is there anything you guys can do for us? Hello, my Avengers. We've been expecting you. Sorry to hear Snout is ill. Vinny the vet will see you now in his office upstairs. You know what? Sometimes we really do underestimate Jarvis. He obviously yeah. rang ahead. And told them that they were we were coming. And he, these guys even knew about Snout. They even knew his name. That's so good. Jarvis is awesome. We gotta uh, we gotta say thanks to him when we get back. Yeah, we gotta we gotta thank him. So we've got Vinny the vet. Well, actually, you know what? The more I think about it, you should probably thank me because I created Jarvis. So whenever you want to thank me, just go ahead and thank me. Yeah, but Jarvis kind of thinks for himself now. So mm. like, I know you did invent him, but he's kind of like his own person, even though he's not a person. He's a computer. That's a whole different thing, Stark. We can get into that again. Okay, so let's just go right ahead. Oh, hello, miss. Um. Do you mind if we just have a look around? We're looking for Vinny the Vet. This place is awesome. Uh, hi there. I'm Nurse Vicky. These are some of the sick animals and newborns we have. We look after here at the vet. Oh, that's cool. So, do you want to have a look around, Cap? Yeah, sure thing. Uh, this dog, hey, he looks cute. pretty much like Snout the way he's sitting down and he doesn't look so good. He's not eating any of his food. Maybe he has the same illness. Yeah, and so does this guy, this little Rottweiler over here. Maybe, I, this must mean we're in the right place, especially if there's other dogs that look the same as Snout. So, oh, look, uh, at, this, look at this. The Dalmatian. little Dalmatian puppy. He's standing, he's standing in his, his food. food. <laughs> oh, look, he's following me around. He's following me around. I don't have any cookies or anything or dog treats to give you. I'm sorry. Stop. Baby chickens. Oh, no. Little chicks. Oh, that is so cool. I love those guys. Oh, we got to get some chickens for the farm. Can we keep them? Can we keep them? Ah. I'm actually surprised. We don't have any chicks for I farm. Know, yeah. Maybe we'll ask uh, the vet Vinny that we can have these little guys. Yeah, we can definitely put these guys to a good home. Oh, look at these guys. They're tiny. Hey, these look pretty pretty happy and cured. That's, that's awesome. Yeah, they must be just newborns. They, they could be for sale even. And oh. this little piggy over here, look at the size of his head. Oh, he reminds whoa. me of you, Stark, with a big massive head. Hey, my head is that big, but it is kind of unproportionate to the rest of his body. <laughs> that is crazy. Um, okay, so let's... Hey, what's this? Oh, this is like a play area. <gasps> oh, Stark, think? come on. It's for the kid and his mom. They're waiting. They must be after us in the queue. Come on, let's get in here and talk to them. I was just trying to see if they had my Iron Man action figure. Y you guys go out and buy it. Okay, so... Um, <laughs> oh, whoa. Okay, th this must be Vet Vinny. Hey, Vet Vinny. Um, we kind of have a problem. My dog Snout is pretty ill and he won't move. And we couldn't get him to come here. So we're thinking maybe... Could you come and see see if you can do anything for him? Oh, hello, you two. Oh, that doesn't sound good if Snout can't even move. There is a rare dog illness going around at the moment. As you can see, one or two of my dogs have it. Um, I think I may need to make a house call. Um, do you mind if I come to the Mind Veggies HQ? Um, yeah, okay, that sounds good. I think that would be best if you made a house call. Um, Stark, does that sound good? Yeah, that sounds perfect to me. I mean, Snout seems too sick to move, and considering the doc says he has some dogs already here that have that rare dog illness, it makes sense if he comes to the house. 
Okay, well, uh, let's get him back there as soon as possible, because I think it's going to get dark soon. Yeah, you're right. Come on, let's go, guys. Hey, Doc, thanks for coming. Um, welcome to our home, but as you can see, Snout is pretty ill. Um, he's so sad in there, it's not good. Do you think you can help him? Yes, of course. That's what I'm here for. I'll go and check out Snout right now. Hmm, it's just as I expected. He does have that rare condition that all the other dogs in my veterinarian have. Hmm, there is a cure for it, but it is quite rare. Luckily enough, we have it in the pharmacy in the city. You'll have to go there tomorrow, though, and pick it up. Um, uh, okay, Doc, yeah, I think you're right. It is getting pretty dark, so I doubt the pharmacy is open now, so I think we're just gonna have to get that tomorrow, Cap. What do you think? Yeah, um, I hope he's gonna be okay overnight. I think I might stay down here with him. Yeah, if you can't move him indoors, I think you should stay down here. Uh, I might I might camp out here with you as well. Just, it'd be fun anyway to keep the dogs company. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. I'm gonna pitch a tent. <laughs> okay, let's do this, my vegers.